What's up today, my fellow Madden soldiers? Today, depending on who you're talking to, or who am I talking to, I mean, I have some exciting and some maybe even be disappointing news. To me, I want to say with me is disappointing because I have, I'm happy with what I did and how I built my team and I got to experience it and actually get it to where I wanted to. So I'm happy with that. However, I have a Cowboy theme team and I wanted to continue to build it with that theme team. And at times, you know, it takes a while for players to come out. You know, I'm pretty sure other players are going to come out. Very good players. And I'm pretty sure I could get it to where I really, really wanted to even more. But the thing is, is that I'm happy. I experienced it. I got play certain the, the main players that I wanted. It's cool. I'm going to keep a, a, quite a few of those players. But what I'm going to tell you right now is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to dismantle the theme team. And the reason why is because, you know, like I said, I enjoyed it, but this is ultimate team right here. And I, I want to continue to build my ultimate team. And I want to be able to try new players out, you know, especially show you guys whenever I can that to have them. So I, it's just going to be, it's going to be a very creative process for me because I don't think I've ever did this right here. I didn't think I'll ever do this. And as you can tell, my theme, my, my team is a 97. With the 97, I got 40 out of 50 Cowboys. My theme team is actually 53 out of 50 Cowboys or, or, or how would you say it themes or whatever like that <clears throat> excuse me but what i'm going to do is i'm going to dismantle it take a lot of players out that i don't that i don't want and that i feel that I could replace with better players to make this team even better and just to make it more interesting and it's probably going to lower my ovr down pretty sure but i'm going to be all right with that though it is what it is i want to make this interesting interesting i mean inter inter interesting and you know, bring you guys different players and different content when I when I can, you know. So without further ado, let's get into it. This is what I got right now. I'm not going to sit here and dismantle the whole team in front of you. I'm not going to go here and bore you guys with that. But I'm just going to show you the players that I have once again and show you who most likely I'm going to get rid of and work on it towards. And I'll bring it back to you once I do. But these are my players right here. I got some goons. The thing is, is that once I dismantle this, my Cowboys team is going to go low, so some of these players are not going to be 99 speed. And some, like this guy's a 99, he's going to go back down to like a 97, 98 maybe. So, you know, things like that to where it's actually going to affect it. Another thing too, what boosts them up so much, like I'm going to keep Byron Jones and Deion Sanders off the top. Like that's that's without without saying, but I'm going to end up getting rid of this guy. He's cool. He's nothing wrong with him. But I have other players. Like I, I kept Darius Slay, and um, I have him. He's powered up all the way so I can power him up. From the last time, but uh, he got a new card today, so I'm gonna go ahead and seek him and make sure that I power him up and get his player. Maybe I don't know if it's gonna be today or within a few days. I don't know when it is, but I'm gonna get him. When I had him on my team in the beginning, that dude was a goon. Like he, he played for my team. Well, I don't know how he plays for other teams, but that dude played for my team. Well, and I'm gonna go ahead and keep him on squad and continue to power him up whenever there's a new card. So, so some of these players I'm gonna keep. Like this guy, Demarcus Lawrence, he's a he's a goon. Don't get me don't get, don't get it twisted, but I'm most likely gonna get rid of him. Why? Because this Shannon Sharp, I really don't use my tight ends like that. He he's cool, but I probably go ahead and work on some other tight ends and get them. And I'm gonna go back to Michael Strahan. He'll be a 99, and I had him in the beginning. And like I said, I enjoyed this team while it lasted, but I'm gonna go ahead and put him back on a squad because I enjoyed him on my team. He actually made a lot of plays. He was fast. And I'm gonna go ahead and bring him back. Bring him back to the team. I only I only did it one time when I switched over. So this will be my second time. If I ever want to trade in the future, I could do it one more time. But this will be my second time doing it. I'm gonna go ahead and go back to him probably. Most likely I'm gonna do that and get rid of a lot of these players. I'm probably gonna get rid of Jaden Smith. Don't get me wrong, he's a goon. But I got Ryan Shazier and I got all these other middle linebackers that they can make up for. You know, as long as I got 199, I'm happy with. So I'm going to go ahead and sell him for coins probably. Like I said, it's going to ruin a lot of my chemistry, whether it's uh, the times two lockdown. I mean, times two. I mean, times uh, two, a three spinner, I mean. I mean, times two speed, but the 30 out 30 sprinter, you know, stuff like that. It's going to affect it. So I'm going to have to really, I'm basically going to have to do a whole rebuilding process. But like I said, it's going to be what it's going to be. I accept that. And I'm going to go ahead and make this interesting. But I want to go ahead and bring it to you guys right now and tell you guys what I'm going to do before I do it so you guys know what to expect. And so... Yeah, in the future, if you guys want to see, who, uh, you guys any suggestions on who you want to see, let me know. But this is probably another guy who I'm gonna get rid of. Look at he's a 98 as a as a power backup. He's actually a goon. But I got a lot of I got a lot of running backs. I even got 
what's his name to do from the from the Giants. Oh my god, I can't believe I forgot that dude's name. That's how, that's how much I play with him now. So let's go over here, click on here. We're gonna go. He'll be right there in the front. There he is, Saquon Barkley. I got this dude right here, and I don't even use him. He's a rookie premier. That's why you know. But he's decent though. He's a decent card. Le'Veon Bell is another one I'm most likely gonna get rid of. Because I don't really use the cards like that, you know. Like I, Ricky Williams is fine. I'm gonna go ahead and just keep. I'll keep Zeke and get rid of these other cards, these running backs, you know, and continue to build my team. So you know, stuff like that, you know, to where, like, I really don't need players. And and eventually, I gotta. This guy's going right here, even without his full eye. This is the nat regular nat version that they gave me. But I'm probably gonna go seek his actual main card and and keep him because he actually plays pretty well. I don't know yet. I'm, I'm still gonna think about who I'm gonna get. Prescott, yeah, he just, this guy just, he just ain't doing it, bro. He, he ain't doing it. So, like I said, I'm going to bring you guys, I bring you guys this update, let you know. If you have any suggestions, let me know in the future what you might want to see. By the time this video gets out, I might be on the dismounting process. I might bot players. I don't know. I don't know what's going to go on. But, like I said, it's going to be a while. I'm going to go ahead and pipe, most likely pop this guy all the way up. So, yeah, that's what it's going to be. So, Thank you guys all for tuning in. Um, if you guys ain't sub to the channel, please go ahead and sub it. <coughs> Dang, excuse me. Hit the notification bell to get notified every time I upload something. If you guys are interested in what I got got to offer, go ahead and like the video if you like what you just heard and you've seen right now. I appreciate you guys. Until uh, next time, I'm out.